Welcome to EA UFC. Coming up next, it's a UFC heavyweight division collision. the strikers in this division sprawl and brawl whatever you want to say he's going to try to keep this fight standing to it does not matter how he accomplishes it all he wants to do is be on his feet and at range hitting you with the beautiful jab staying away from the grappling exchanges you don't accomplish all the things that this man has accomplished over the course of his career without understanding distance he has great distance management which then in turn allows him to land all these beautiful diverse kicks Spinning back kick, jumping high kick, so many things he possesses that he will try to use tonight in this fight. Yeah, if this turns into a kickboxing match tonight, most it's people over. believe, yeah, his opponent is in a it's world over, of trouble. Well, you can argue this is the most influential martial artist of all time, the great Bruce Lee, making his walk to the octagon here tonight, champ. Everybody wants to be Bruce Lee. They say they want to be like Mike. If you're a fighter, you want it to be like Bruce Lee. You want it to be that fast. You want it to be that charismatic. You want it to have an ability to just freeze your opponents. Your speed, your movement, just the diversity in the attacks that you can give your opponents would just confuse people. I mean, I watched him beat a seven foot Kareem at the bar to stay undefeated. Right. If you can do that, you can do anything. I fear not the man who has practiced 10,000 kicks once, but I fear the man who has practiced one kick 10,000 times, Bruce Lee in a nutshell. Just so wise. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge of the octagon, Dan Bergliata. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the sold-out Madison Square Garden Arena in New York City, it's time! Five rounds in the UFC heavyweight division. Introducing first, fighting out of the blue corner. This man is a kickboxer, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands six feet one inch tall, weighing in at 164 pounds. Chico! And now we're producing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds, fighting out of Los Angeles, California, Bruce the Dragon! All right, Grinton rules in the locker room. I want you to obey my commands at all times, protect yourself at all times. I want a nice, clean, safe fight. Touch gloves, back your corners, come out fight. They touch him up, and we are underway. You ready? You ready? Let's go. Well, the tension is palpable as this fight gets underway, and it'll be interesting to see how this matchup plays out. Definite striker on one side against another guy who can really do it all. And in those situations, normally the guy that's more well-rounded will be the one that will find success. I want to see how this plays out. Big kick land. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Connects with a right. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Really timing his shots nicely. Good tempo, very accurate, finding the range with relative ease. Yeah, he's doing a great job of really overwhelming his opponent with activity. Nice punch, Lynch. Yes! 
Trying to find a home for that right hand. I mean, he's cutting him down the side with these beautiful leg kicks. Look at the flip action that comes from him throwing that kick. And just misses with that big right hand. Big head kick lands. Once again, making good use of his size as he lands the knee. Just missed with the left there. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Three minutes now, round one. Ooh, what a head kick. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Is all about that left kick to the body. Look at him chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Came of inches right there, Damn boy. It. Wow. It was a good night if that landed. Big off punch lands. Now he gets back to range. He's got a serious right punch, and he wins. as effective as straight punches we've seen all night. Huge straight punch lands, and he's got to hurt very bad. Back to the feet. Just misses there with the left. A nice job to land a knee to the body, man. I wish I was that tall. Just unable to quite find that range. Leg kick. Just misses with a left hook there. All right, so a nice shot there defensively to raise the guard. Oh. Serve him up. Go get him. Gets up again here, but hurting. Establish that jab. Do not back up. Let's go forward now. Big kick. So he's really starting to put together some significant body shots here. These are going to take their toll as this fight goes on. Oh, beautiful technique for him there on that side kick. See, it doesn't always pay to be the taller fighter. In this instance, it most certainly did. Big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one? Oh! Entertaining scrap so far. All right, so a high level round there for him. We'll show you some of the action here, and you gotta think the knockdown is gonna be featured prominently here. Thought he might have had him out of there. He thought he had him, but the guy's tough. The guy's durable. He has a fantastic chin. But he just needs to stay the course. He does not need to be discouraged. Think about this. You're winning, and you're winning going away. That was just a moment. Keep going in the same direction, and you will get the finish that you want so bad. just continues to punish his opponent's midsection here in this round. Huge block there. Changes his stance. You'll see a lot of this from this fighter. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Look at the turtle in that kick. 
kick. What a tricky head kick. Strong defense there to block the shot. Nice instincts. Jab yet again out of range. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. Beautiful strike. Oh, big knee to the body. That'll soften him up. All right, so he's landed some good shots tonight, but this is not a combo meal, right? No three-piece, no soda. It's oh, shot finds the target there. Great shot lands. Now he's got to go find that follow-up attempt. The kill shot is what they call it to go and end the fight. He has a commitment to kick it tonight, and it shows. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, locking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Gets the elbow up into the target. Kickboxing chops on full display with that offering. Nicely done. Beautiful kick landed by this man. Well, a really good second round for him thus far after a somewhat lackluster first round. There. He landed it perfectly. Perfect placement. Perfect position. What a huge blow in a big moment in this fight. Oh, huge block. Oh. He needs to start looking to finish now because he's got to Again, but he looks like he's compromised. The left punch is true, now the right hand. Well, it's one thing to have length, it's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, setting up the left hook, but out of range. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You gotta like what you're seeing thus far. I mean, the speed at which he throws is crazy. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Man, he just gets better with every fight. Another kick to the leg landed there by Lee. Fast, straight, hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Trying to inflict some damage here, but misses with the kick. Able to check that kick as well. Nice. victory here tonight. It's hard to land a strike more flush than he did right there, and I'm not even sure the opponent saw it coming. So he'll see the replay and probably shake his head, but ultimately this is a huge result and a huge win for that fighter here tonight. All right, DC, no Telestrator tonight, but we're going to get you some highlights from this one. This was a fight that had it all, and for my money, his best performance to date. His best performance to date in the biggest moment. In the biggest moment, you got to show up. And that's exactly what he did tonight. He used every bit of his skill to get the job done. The official decision is in. That's where we find Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Dan Mergliata has called a stop to this contest at three minutes, 59 seconds of round number two. Declaring the winner by knockout, Chief God. All right, so there he is, the man of the moment, celebrating one of the bigger knockout victories of his career. And that'd be nice sometimes with all the hard work that you guys put in when it goes down exactly the way you drew it up. A lot of people talk about doing certain things. It's harder to deliver on those promises you make to the public. Tonight, he did exactly that. Congratulations. I'm going to purchase some things that I know will not fill my needs. The dose of what I've achieved and get lonesome.